And so I figure I'll do a proper um, uh, first video, first video with the uh, new flip. So um, uh, here's a little bit of light. This is my front door, my brand new front door. And outside, my car. Hooray car, let's turn the light on out here just in case, turn that off. And stepping outside now. That, that there, let's zoom out to give it a little bit of a better look. That is the cornfield across the way. Can't see it very well, but there you go. Not much here. It's a small town. 600 people. That was a local police car. It looks like they have two. <laughs> Thought they only had the one. Looks like they have two cop cars here. Silly me. It's my neighbors. And I'm just trying to get to the end of the street here. This fucking driveway is covered with gravel. That, right there, that is the only light in this town. It's not even really a stoplight, it's just a four way stop. It, but it has a bl red blinker to let you know. And you know, here's my, there's my car. It's my car. Just said that, didn't I? Huh. Batting a thousand a day. Nice little car. You see a dent there. That's a healthy looking bruise. Let's see if I can come around here, see the front, pan around, and get a good shot of this. This, kids, is why you don't run into fire hydrants with your cars. Because in a, in a battle between a car built after 1970 and a fire hydrant, the fire hydrant's usually going to win. A little nowhere. About a mile that way through my apartment, which is north. About a mile that way, there's a major highway. About two miles that way, there's another one. But that one runs southwest, northwest, northwest, southeast at this point. And if you go straight east, about five miles, you get to a road that runs through most of central Illinois. So, you know, you got that. Little town, pretty much how it looks at night. It's nine o'clock and the town is shut down. I can see right now.